strength practice three, we're keeping this theme of more unilateral focus or more asymmetrically loaded focus. We're gonna open up A1 with a suitcase deadlift. So we have to do suitcase carries. Essentially it just means we're holding a weight on one side, relatively speaking, to the other. So we're gonna do one kettlebell off to the side in a suitcase-like fashion for 80 shots. So just like we would on a normal deadlift, very hingy, bringing that kettlebell down to the ground, but it's gonna be offloaded to one side. You're gonna find it's gonna challenge that core, that pillar, a lot more than we just have bilaterally loaded. We're gonna pair this up with an asymmetrical block push-up. So my hands are gonna be raised up on two blocks on one side, and we're gonna do four each, progressing that up to eight each over the course of four weeks, also with a 3 exo tempo. So very asymmetrically focused here. B1 is gonna be a kettlebell single arm front squat, just like we talked about on that suitcase deadlift, offloaded side, we'll have to give some sort of centering point, so we'd like to tell people put their hand in front to give some sort of gauge of where their arm is, relatively speaking. Three sets of eight with a three count down on each side. We're gonna pair this up with a bent over row, single arm, so I'm gonna get into a good hinge position, one arm at a time. We like to put that arm out to the side if you need some sort of balance point or some sort of reference of where the torso is in space, just like we were talking about that, uh, that front squat. And we're gonna finish off with a tall kneeling farmer's hold. So again, grabbing two heavy kettlebells, 30 seconds, eights all the way across the board, three sets, three exo tempo with the exception of that tall kneeling farmer's hold, 30 seconds.